everybody. Welcome back to another episode. Outdoors with Bradley and Darren. Tonight is archery night. Archery, maybe. <laughs> we'll see. Um, new bow here. Um, I don't like getting new things. A um, couple of reasons why is because you're trying to fine tune it. It's a little aggravating. Um, so, you know, that's where we're at right now. As you can see, we got Allen wrenches everywhere, adjusting everything. So, you know. So what's the problem with your uh, with your new setup here? So right now, my problem is is that when I shoot at 20 yards, I'm very, very low. And uh, I'm afraid of moving my actual sight down too far because then I'm worried about my flexion contacting it when it flies out. So just made another quick adjustment real quick, so we're gonna try it out and then go from there. <laughs> but what I did is I, I changed my mountain locations for my for my sights to um, to move them out and down just a little bit. Um, you can you can't see from the target here, but I'm probably maybe what do you think? Eight inches low, right? And eight inches, eight low. inches to the left. Yeah. So. <laughs> We got a little work to do, so we'll we'll let you take a break. Um, I'm gonna do some more adjustments here, and then we'll fire one down range, see where we're at. And in the meantime, Darren is gonna get his crossbow cocked, locked, and ready to rock. He's gonna send one down range too. So, yeah, sit tight. Yeah. So uh, while Bradley's still adjusting, we'll uh, kind of go over my little setup. It's something that um, my wife traded for, so it's probably not the best but it's something to get out there and get in the woods with. So I've just got a little crossbow here, and uh, and this is what we're gonna be shooting at. Uh, right here at the edge of the driveway, we're at 20 yards. So I've got a GoPro set up down there, and I will fire one off, and we'll see how good a shot I really am. Okay, so we made an adjustment. Like I said, we've kind of moved the sights out and down. Um, We'll see how it goes. Um, I don't know. Um, not this. If this don't work, I guess we'll go round three. In the exact same spot. Well, all right. Well, you'll man the camera for a minute, and then uh, yeah. I'll uh, take a shot with the old uh, crossbow, see what happens. So, I'm gonna make a little bit more in-depth adjustments to mine. I, I believe it's actually the rest now because uh, I moved I moved my pins, a uh, pretty drastic change, and it hit in the exact same spot. Um, and I've had this issue before with one of my previous bows. I was, I had to, I was getting the same exact issue to where I had moved my pins all the way down and I was still hitting low. And what it was is I had a, um, a drop zone arrow rest, which means, you know, pretty much when you pull back, it brings your rest up. And then as soon as you release, it brings it down and it's contactless, right? So, and what was happening was it wasn't bringing my arrow all the way up so didn't matter how much i adjusted my pins or anything like that it was it was only bringing my arrow up so far so um i think that's the current situation i'm in right now so we're gonna let darren fire one off down range see how it goes and then uh, i'm gonna make another adjustment and we'll go from there um darren's having some technical difficulties right now getting his camera to uh to come on you know this wireless stuff it's it's kind of a it's kind of a nuisance sometimes it's not safe to run with equipment it's unloaded though it's, so it's okay I got, I got it it's un, I it's one. unloaded it's unloaded running see <laughs> unloaded so so it's okay it's okay to run with equipment when it's unloaded um but uh you know like he said he's got a he's got a barnet crossbow right here that he's just started i mean how many Wired. times have you fired it before this Three or four. Three or four times. So first year right here with it. So let's uh let's sit back and watch him. Get a good angle from here, maybe. Right, see how it goes. Top left. top left, top left. Oh, and it's a hit. 
it's a head a little a little left, a little left. um i pulled it i think you could kill one with that though yeah you're in range yeah i'm close yeah close enough <laughs> all right here we go he made another adjustment let's see let's see if this one's a little bit better yeah this one is actually to the rest um see what happens maybe i won't take out the gopro <laughs> Hey, that's better. It's a lot better, isn't it? Yeah. So that's uh let's go fuck down here and take a look. Pretty much even. Maybe a little <clears throat> high, a little to the left. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. But you can tell before that adjustment to my rest, I was hitting here both yeah. shots. So that one, I moved it here. So now I just want to move it here. So I'm going to move my sights this time and see where I'm at. But it's a lot better. Yeah. A lot better. All because of moving. <laughs> All right. I think I might load up, take another shot too. Do it. Let's see what happens. Yeah. Well, welcome back. <laughs> here goes Darren. Going to take another shot. We're gonna change the arrows just to see, make sure we're all good to go. Okay. So, did you mention our yardage right here over 20 yards, right? I did. Okay. Now, this is not gonna be our limitation shot of 20 yards. Yeah, I don't know if, see, I wish we could see through the, uh, the scope so you could see, like, it's got different range lines on it. Well, there's a picture on the side of the scope. Yeah, that's what it looks like right there. Oh yeah, when you're looking through the scope, it looks like this. You know, you got different yardages. Um, I don't know which one they're all for. I guess your zero. <laughs> yeah. I guess your zero could be uh, 20 yards, and 20 then is what I've been probably doing. like normal, like 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, like a normal um, compound bow setup. I know that's usually how I do mine. Like my top pin, I set at 20, and then I go 30, 40, 50, 60. However, all right. So, so now Darren's fixing, get ready to fire one down range we'll get behind him a sweet angle shot here all right we're going at the center of the b center of the b my friends i think that's a dead b <laughs> let's go check and see if this is a dead b or not to me to me i think it would be um and uh it it appears to be oh no man you missed Just the B. Off. It's not. It's so lucky. <laughs> it missed that curve of the B. The B. That curve of the B went right through. Oh man. Man. By the way, I'll go ahead and tell you, I mean it's a dead B. Yeah. Because you gotta think you're you're cut you're using a two inch broadhead. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I mean it it slice that jugular vein for it and it'd bleed out <laughs> in ten seconds. Be it'd done. Get that yeah, so all right, well, I'm going to get ready. I'm going to get mine up, and we'll see where my next shot is. All right, here's Bradley. All right, one more adjustment to the sights this time, so we'll see where we're at. We're going for the white target, center mass. See where we're at. Pulled that one a little bit. Just a little left. I pulled that one. I know I did. But, same spot. Yeah, so you're about, what, two inches right from yeah. where you were? Yeah. So, that was the first shot there. That's the second shot. Oh. Watch out! I'm back hitting. <laughs> All right, so, uh, another adjustment? Yeah, I'm gonna make a figure out which way i need to move it all right yeah. parks are getting new things <laughs> yeah all part of getting the new right yeah yeah all right another adjustment coming at you yeah all right possibly the last shot from that it's getting dark yeah one more judgment worst case it goes to the pro shop tomorrow
That's pretty close. Maybe. <laughs> Pretty close. That's not too bad. Yeah. Fine tuning from there. Fine tuning. That'll work. Well, this so, will probably be the last uh, last video for the night. Yeah. It's starting so, to get a little dark out. Yeah. Not good uh, camera light, so you know we'll pick it up again this <laughs> week. Uh, I got off work a little late today, so. Yeah. You know, we'll, uh, I drive an hour, so. <laughs> so. As always, appreciate you guys watching. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. If you like it, subscribe. Um, Share the get, word. Yeah, you know, get, get us, us out there. Up. Yeah. yeah. Thumbs up, like. Yeah. Hit that notification button. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So until next time, we'll see you later. Appreciate it.